Good morning, YouTube. It's me, Justin. October 22nd, 2018. It's currently 2.45 a.m. I'm up again. No chest pains or nothing, but I uh, was watching some breaking news. Um, pretty much uh, put your seatbelts on and prepare for a wild ride come morning in the next few days and next weeks or months. Uh, the Trump administration is considering the redefinition of transgenderism and um, basically putting it back to the way it used to be. If you have a dinker, use the men's room. If you have a hoo-hoo, use the women's restroom. And um, basically defining that a gender is based on your genitalia, not what you decide in your brain, what you think you are. Um, how it's going to affect uh, federal regulations when it comes to using the bathroom, when it comes to registering for um, certain programs, um, such as maybe food stamps, stuff like that. So at a federal level, um, there is going to be no more of this, well, I recognize as a female, so you know I'm being discriminated against and blah, 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 blah. Um, it's going back to the science, the biology of it. Um, not, I just wake up one morning. Well, I'm a sick, uh, I'm a sick pedophile creep. So I'm gonna, you know, not me. I'm saying these uh, pedophile creeps. Uh, I'm gonna put a wig on and I'm gonna go in a little girl's bathroom today at Target because I identify as a woman. You know, now you're a closet pedophile and you're getting away with it because of your sick, demented, far left ideology that you're protected under um so anyways i think it's a really good thing and uh to be honest um we weren't going to get the uh the that vote anyways for midterm elections so um you know it's going back to the days before uh slobama changed everything up and um the far left ideology allowed such craziness, you know, I was telling on my live stream the other day, just filling out paperwork on some stuff. Everything I come across was male, female, or other. You know, there was a day when that was never. So hopefully, you know, it goes back to that. And, um, you know, when you go to, when you're a man and you commit a crime and you go to prison, you don't go to a woman's prison just because you hacked off your junk, pardon me, between your legs. No matter what, your Y chromosomes or whatever, you know, the, the biological part is what sends you to a male prison. And, uh, you know, or a female doesn't go to a male prison because she thinks she's a he or whatever. And it doesn't work like that. So this is all I'm saying is just... Put on your seatbelt, sit back, and enjoy the ride because just more craziness going to happen um, for sure from the far left, rioting and all that stuff. So they're going to take this one and run with it. So, and uh, we got that caravan going across uh, Mexico right now. So all this crazy stuff right, be right before midterm elections. But anyways... Um, it's the way it should be, honestly. Just because you, you wake up one morning and you want to get certain, um, you know, handouts or, you know, say, you know, a pity party or a lawsuit that you're being discriminated against, you know, it's just, it opens doors. It's, it's just such nonsense, you know. If you feel like you're a woman but you're not, you know, it sucks for you. Pray for you, but. You don't get all the benefits or whatever. You're not entitled to nothing. God made you man. God made you woman. You don't choose that on your own. So, and just by chopping something off or adding something on doesn't biologically make you something different. It's, you know, internally in your head you may feel you are, but biologically you're not. And the laws don't have to abide by you. You have to abide by the laws. Like all of us else do. So, anyways, you got a dinker?
use the men's room. Got a hoo-hoo, women's room. Pardon me if that offends some people, but it's just the way it is. And if you cut it off, well, still got to use the men's room. So, fear no man, never fear death. Get right with God, fight the good fight, stay locked and loaded 100%. Thank you for all your thoughts and prayers. No chest pains, just uh, not wide awake, but just happened to wake up and saw that. Thought I'd do a video. Some breaking news that came across. So, it's going to be crazy. Libs are going to go nuts. It's the end of the world. Oh my gosh, what's going to happen? It's the end of the world. Well, I don't think our forefathers had transgender bathrooms. I think we'll survive. Fear no man, never fear death. Get right with God. Fight the good fight. Stay locked and loaded. Later.